Hello, my name is Tom Kerner with Seed Skitty National Wildlife Refuge. We thought it'd be a good time to give you an update on a project that Seed Skitty Chapter Trout Unlimited helped sponsor out here on Seed Skitty National Wildlife Refuge. Uh, it involved uh, a fish screen that keeps trout of all sizes, including small fry, out of our irrigation ditch. What we had found was that uh, a significant number of trout and other fish species were ending up in our irrigation ditch system that we used to flood our wetlands. And, and those trout could not get out of the wetland system and the ditch system, so they would end up dying each year. So we did a, a, a couple of falls worth of electroshocking to determine how many trout were being trapped in the ditch system. We determined there was thousands and thousands of them. And at that point, we started to formulate a plan. We'd identified that this, this head gate was an issue for the fisheries in, in the river here. Uh, Nick Walrath with uh, Wyoming Trout Unlimited spearheaded the project and uh, put together many partners, uh, including uh, local Seed Skitty chapter of Trout Unlimited, Wyoming Game and Fish Department, uh, the Wyoming Commissioner's Big Game Tag, Wyoming Wildlife and Natural Resources Trust, and the Wyoming Game and Fish Department Trust. And this project would not happen without the partners. Uh, the first step of the project was to determine how to do the project. Uh, we were able to, to hire One Fish Engineering. They came up with a design that they thought would work best here, uh, but a cone screen, and it's got little tiny holes in it, lets the water through. It's got a rotating brush that uh, keeps the screen clear. And the key feature on the design is you had to make the screen big enough that it wouldn't suck small fish onto the screen and kill them. Uh, I've observed clouds of f fish fry swimming right up to the screen um, and not being affected by it at all. So obviously they're not being sucked onto the screen and killed. So and then to just tell you what, what you're looking at here. So this is a, uh, three solar panels uh, that power the brushes on the screen. So we don't have electricity to this site. Uh, so we had to use solar to do that. Uh, charges uh, a bank of batteries. And then when the brushes turn on, they go a couple times one way, a couple times the other. Clears the holes in the screen. And uh, this has been, been working perfect. Uh, we didn't have any other way of running running electricity to this site. Construction was done in the fall of 2014 uh, by Flare Construction. Uh, they did a fantastic job. So more than two years of operation now, uh, we've had um, excellent results. Um, it's actually reduced our maintenance required to keep our ditches clear because it's not letting in the debris uh, into the ditch system. Um, fish can't get into the system so we have completely eliminated uh, any, any entrainment trapping fish. So the end result is just what we all had hoped for. It's achieving its objective of uh, keeping fish out of the ditch system and the quality of the construction, it should last 20 plus years more. So just a quick update, appreciate uh, taking time to, to listen to our update here. And um, again, thanks to all the partners and in particular uh, Trout Unlimited for making this happen.